after months of searching for a convicted killer, Gerard Price is now back behind bars. And tonight we're hearing from the victim's family. Price was convicted of killing their son, Carl Smalls, back in 2002. His family has been pleading for the public's help in getting Price back behind bars since his release in March. Deputy Smith number popped up and, and he just asked if it was me. Yes, sir. And he just said, we got him. That was his first way. We got him. And I went and told her, I mean, and that just, just made our day. Oh, yeah. Exactly. Attorney General Alan Wilson says he's not sure how long it will take to bring Price back to South Carolina. It could be days, maybe even weeks before he's extradited. As for additional charges, Wilson says that Price didn't escape, that he was released, in his words, erroneously. But they are looking at that possibility. Now, Price was arrested in New York yesterday after a four-month search. He was released in March after serving 19 years of a 35-year sentence. His attorney argues the early release was warranted after Price assisted two corrections officers who were being beaten in separate attacks. Price is credited with saving their lives. He also tipped authorities off about an inmate escape. However, the state Supreme Court didn't agree with his early release and ordered him back to prison. That was in late April.